No, Veer was good. I'm just saying like a Galaxy Soldier might have been a little better. You know? No, Hertz was good too. The trap, no, not the trap. Don't go that far. No, don't go that far now. The trap's, <laughs> no, it's not very good. No, you gotta give us something else. Uh, like, I don't know, a new spell card. Like, I don't know, a power bond searcher? <sighs> Guys, I don't know how to get through to you. I don't know what else to say. No, no, it's not that. You know, Guys, I, I'm not gonna lie, this is really stressing me out. I need, I need to take a break. I need to take a break. Oh my god, I don't know how to get through that. Hey, Cosmo support! So as you guys already know and have been blowing me up about, we have a new Cyber Dragon card called Cyber Rev System, and it's freaking amazing. I love it. It's just, it's a, it's a monster reborn, guys. I don't even need to put its effect up here, okay? I, I'm going to anyway. It says you can special summon one Cyber Dragon from your graveyard or from your hand, and it can't be destroyed. That's it. Like, it's freaking good, and it's not once per turn. I don't know what to say. Like, I am completely and totally speechless right now. This card is actually really, really good. It actually is what Cyber Dragons kind of needed. Um, but I'm not going to just stand here and ramble on all day. Um, I want to really test this card out in Cyber Dragons. But really quick before I do, I have to give a huge shout out to all my patrons. All of you guys are absolutely fantastic. You keep this channel going. I appreciate you so, so much, you guys. I, you, don't, you don't know what it means to me. Like, you will never know what it means to me. But I will keep making videos. I will keep making videos as long as you guys keep watching you guys are absolutely fantastic but now with all of that out of the way i'm sorry let's go ahead and get into this and start playing these cards because it's freaking great that we got this and what's really cool is that now that the cyber dragon mat is officially coming out i can play on this bad boy oh my gosh this is amazing i get to finally show this on camera it's freaking amazing so this is what i've been playing on <laughs> instead of the other cyber dragon mat this is the mat i've been playing on guys this is the one i showed you guys recently and it's freaking killer it's way killer but that's not the subject of this video guys um for right now i, I want to show you guys um you know what what cards i'm playing so that you can follow along with the combos if you want to um although i will note that um <laughs> looking at this i already want to add the brilliant fusion back in uh, i i really do like i want the i want uh, three brilliance and the garnet back in and i want this to be a one for one um i'm pretty sure that's what i want right now anyways um but uh, that's just th those are just my notes for right now um uh, but for this video we're gonna go ahead and play with the symphonic warrior engine because you know they're commons and everyone can get their hands on them so uh, for the purposes of this video guys this isn't you know a completed deck profile and cybernetic horizon is a like long long ways away this is just something you know once again i just kind of uh, slapped together if you will so um let's go ahead and uh run through this really quick so you guys know what i'm playing so um three cyber dragon and then three core and then three dry and i just maxed out on all of them so <laughs> three hertz uh three uh veer uh three galaxy soldier and then uh, maxed out on the symphonic warrior guitar uh two mics uh, one golden jet and one jizakira if we draw the Jizakiru, I'll probably shuffle it back and, uh, you know, because uh, it's a better going second card. Although, you can pitch this off a Galaxy Soldier, so that's not bad. Uh, three of the new spell card, because it's freaking good. <laughs> it's, like, amazing. Uh, three Machine Dupe. Uh, three Instant Fusion. Two Repair Plants. One Burial. Um, Monster Reborn. Reasoning. And a Soul Charge. And that is all for the main. Um, then, uh, for the extra, it's just uh, two Nova. Two Infinity. Uh, Pleiades, Dorindel, Saramea, and then um, I'm running a rank four <laughs> because this has been on my radar for the deck. Uh, it, it really has been. It's been, uh, you know, I, I haven't showed you guys, and I don't ever show anybody, you know, <laughs> you know what cards I have picked out. But um, I have like these different cards that I have, like these different lists of cards that I have that are like good in different decks that I can like, you know, use in the future. And uh, uh, this was on that list for Zyber Dragon. So, and uh, now that we have Veer being a level four to go with Dry, I figured it'd be uh, around about the time to uh, try to you know break this into the deck so uh, one iron wolf that, that is one I'm running right now but you guys can you know do whatever you want uh, once again this is just for example purposes and then um, two uh, panzer dragon um, I bumped up the instant fusion target to two uh, for this video um, I'll probably really only ro run one because of uh, extra deck space and stuff I'm having to run two nova and two infinity because it's just the best number but um, fortress dragon and the mega fleet uh, the only two chimera techs I run because I cut um, uh, overload fusion out so um, 
you don't need the rampage obviously and then uh seeger um because it's freaking good <laughs> shout outs to my homeboys my, my boys inspector collectibles for making this for me they're freaking great uh cleefort genius and then uh decode talker and that's all for the uh extra deck guys but now with all of that out of the way um you know what? i should probably pile shuffle let me pile shuffle and then uh let's play out some hands and see how good cyber dragons are right now all right cut this in half and let's see what we get with what kind of hand we have oh no we drew the mics this hand kind of sucks let's go ahead and play this out as a is a uh, practice hand though uh with this uh this is kind of this is like really really interesting um let's do uh, going first this isn't really doing us any good going first so i guess we'll pitch that off a guitar and then go into do 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 where's the other mics at so mics and we can just pendulum summon uh this out or yeah i mean we could do that this hand really sucks <laughs> i'm gonna be honest this hand really sucks i'm not even gonna play that hand that, that hand was garbage maybe this time we'll get an actual hand that's a little better there we go that is way better okay so uh, what we're gonna do with this hand guys and i really wish uh this is kind of awkward because um with this one um it's like you want to pitch this is another reason why um you know brilliant fusion would be better um if this was brilliant fusion this would just be way way better because you wouldn't have to like think about this so much you would just normal summon this and use this as your machine duplication target versus now where it's like oh man so i can use that as my machine duplication targets or i can go guitar and like pitch this off a guitar and go in the mics so like it's uh, i don't know man i think for this let's just let's just uh, leave the guitar out of it because guitar you could pitch like any card it doesn't have to be a monster but like you would want to pitch this so you can get the search for cyber dragon but i don't know man uh, let's go ahead and just uh you know do this let's normal summon let's put our field centers uh, out there so let's go ahead and i guess uh, normal summon this and then uh chain our uh, veer so special summon veer and then um let's i guess this is so awkward guys so awkward um i think what i want to do actually is summon this here here special summon this here um let's go ahead and symphonic warrior guitar pitch soul charge i know that's so weird that's so that's so bizarre and weird i know i know i know i know but uh, the reason why is because uh, you, you guys are about to see so pitch that uh, go into that but um what i'm gonna do is use these two so stack this in the extra deck and use um use the veer to go into genius and then a uh, machine dupe and that's how we're gonna do it because this guy's name is treated as cyber dragon so what that will do is get us um two cyber dragons wherever they're at so two cyber dragons then that will kick in giving us a search for galaxy soldier um so that is kind of cool and you can you don't have to search galaxy soldier you can search any um you know level five or higher machine uh, from your deck off of the cleefort genius uh but you, so you can search a just a cure if you wanted to but i'm just gonna search galaxy soldier for now um this is like so we have a second normal summon by the way yeah let's go ahead and search galaxy soldier why not that that hand kind of sucked and then we're gonna use our second normal summon off of the mics that we summoned out to uh, summon this guy the, the galaxy soldier we searched for and then that will kick in when it's sent to the graveyard and get us the last cyber dragon out of our deck and then from here what we can do is just like the normal kind of cyber dragon moves that we always do and go into um, nova and then detach uh, summon and then uh, slap infinity on this and then for now you would uh, how i would end this is i would go dorindle because uh, dorindle can pop your face up guitar so that is pretty good we started with five cards um ended with five cards but not uh, we didn't get to take advantage of that soul charge and stuff with that hand i mean we could have played that different to use soul charge i'm pretty sure but it's just that was kind of a weird hand let's go ahead and try to force and um, we need to either you know uh, force the new spell card into our hand or try to draw it or search it off of a uh, cyber dragon course so let's shuffle and actually try to draw into the new spell if i don't draw into the new spell or a cyber dragon core i'll shuffle up again and we'll play out a new hand because this is supposed to be us playing out so there we go so uh, what we could do out of this let's just you know what i'm gonna rig up a hand let's pretend we didn't draw that let's draw a different card Ooh, there we go <laughs> that's how that's how we'll play this out because i was like oh we can't draw two machine dupe and draw the cyber dragon that's weak that's so weak uh, so what we'll do a uh, normal summon and then uh, since we have this in hand we'll go ahead and search out the repair plants like we normally do so normal summon uh, search out repair plants and then uh, from for this uh, what i would do um you know let's go ahead uh, this is this is what i'm gonna do right here um let's go machine dupe uh uh, this is gonna be kind of weird. So this machine dupe for one because it's up to two um, Go into Yeah, it's going to Cleefort genius, right? Yeah, that's how well, that's what we'll have to do So go into Cleefort genius and then um, activate repair plants to search out galaxy soldier Yeah, that's what we'll do. So search out galaxy soldier and then what we'll do is Activate this our new spell card to bring out cyber dragon core 
and then activate the second machine duplication to get out the two cyber dragons. There we go. Yes, dude. I'm freaking loving this already. This is amazing. And then Genius will kick in. Um, and Genius can get us to search for any light machine. Uh, no, 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 no. Um, we already bur burned our normal, so I guess it doesn't really matter what we search for. Uh, search is a level five or higher machine, I should say. Not any light machine. Search is a level five or higher machine. Galaxy Soldier, we can go ahead and search out another Galaxy Soldier because what we can do is we can um, pitch Galaxy Soldier um, off of Galaxy Soldier like so and uh, get another search for a Galaxy Soldier so we can uh, get all three of them out of our deck. So that's kind of good, I guess. I don't know. Um, but uh, from here, um, what I think we should do probably, I mean, we can, we can extend to a full board. Um, you know how I would want to end right here? I'm gonna show you guys again how I've how I've ended before, you know, with Cyber Dragons in the past. Uh, the, for the for here, since we don't have like a face up spell card, I think the best the way to end would be to go summon, and then slap the Infinity on this, and then use these two go into Pleiades, activate Pleiades, to bounce this to hand. Uh, the reason why is because, and I've explained this in the past, you know, in the previous Cyber Dragon videos and stuff like that, but um, what you, why you did do that is because you still have a bounce during your opponent's turn, you know, because you know you only need to attach one material. Um, and then also, um, this core in your hand for next turn gives you a search for another repair plant, and that repair plant can get you to Jizakiru, and that Jizakiru gets over anything that your opponent can get out, and then you can Chimera tech your opponent. So, yeah, that is, uh, that's something I've explained in the past in a combo I've showed you guys, you know, a billion times on the channel now, but it's something I came up with a long time ago, and I really feel like it's optimal to end uh, first turn Cyber Dragon boards that way, to end with that uh, Pleiades, unless, of course, uh, you have, you know, a face up spell card out to where you can, uh, you know, target it with a Durindal, like, you know, Brilliant Fusion or that symphonic warrior guitar either way this is uh this is not bad either wow this is okay all right let's play this out um let's oh my gosh this is this is crazy okay uh let's, let's activate guitar um i'm gonna pitch that go into let's go into mics that'll give us a second normal summon that's really good um that will kick in giving us cyber dragon um, let's go ahead and normal summon and then chain this. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's go ahead and normal summon. Chain. Yeah, let's go to normal summon, chain that. Yeah, that's what we'll do. And then um, this will activate, giving us repair plan because we already have the uh, the special summon our monster reborn. So let's go ahead and um, search out the repair plants. We do have a cyber dragon engraved, so we can actually go ahead and um, activate this and search for Galaxy Soldier, which is insane. Guys, this card is nuts. Oh my gosh, this card is nuts. Okay, so. Whoo! How do I how do I even want to do this? Okay, so um, I wish I had I wish I had a machine dupe right here. The only thing missing from this is machine dupe to freaking go like way ham on that. But um, uh, let's just keep playing this out. So uh, Galaxy Soldier, I guess. Yeah. So Galaxy Soldier, um, search for another copy of Galaxy Soldier. Wow, this is pretty insane, guys. This is. This is looking really, really fun. I'm not gonna lie, uh, but let's summon. Um, yeah, let's. Uh, we can do that. Um, let's go into Cleefor Genius though. Let's use uh, these two. That'll go here. This will get stacked in the extra deck. Go into or did uh, should I use? No, no, no. I don't want to use that. I don't want to use our level five. I want to use this. I want to use these two. That's what I want to do. I want to use those two to go into Genius, so we have like an extra level five on the board. Um, then uh, what you do is you overlay uh, these two. Go into Nova, and then activate summon out. Cyber Dragon, like so, and then slap the Infinity on top of the Nova, and then activate our Monster Reborn to summon out. Oh, wait, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on. If, if I summon this guy out, um, is, each, is each of his effects one, once per turn, or is it just like one or the other? Because I can special summon this guy out, and when he's special summoned, he'll make himself a level five, and I've only summoned machines this turn, so that's good, right? Because I can overlay for these two and go into Durendo again to target the guitar. Um, you know, so that my, uh, I don't know, I don't know. Um, can I do that? Can I do that? Let me read uh, Let me read up on this guy's effect again really quick. You can only use one of this card's two and three effects per turn and only once per, per turn. So each effect is once per turn, right? I think, I'm pretty sure each effect is once per turn. So in other words, when this comes back, it should be special summoned as a level five and that should allow us to go into Durindal. Um, that should be what happens. Uh, that's, that's how we would end that board. That is really good though. And if it doesn't come back as level five, then, then I'm pretty, like I'm pretty 
pretty sure it does, then then oh well. Like, I mean, we still got it. It's still freaking good. So, um, that, I'm really impressed. So, guys, my initial thoughts on the card are that it's freaking good. Like, it is way good. Um, it, it helps you go into, um, it helps, you, like, it just, it, it helps you go into, um, you know, Cleave for Genius more. It helps you get a Genius's effect off. Um, it just, it does everything. Like, going seconds, like, oh my gosh. It helps you get a Cyber, cyber Dragon out for Chimera Tech. Like, Konami did a fantastic job with this spell card, guys. This spell card is, that's it. This is, yeah, like, that's it. This, this is what the deck needed. Like, it, it freaking works. It works well, and it's not once per turn. And it's a, it's another cyber card that you can search off of core. You know, I hate to say it because I want my power bond searcher still. I, I still want my power bond searcher, but but if we don't get the power bond searcher and this is the new cyber card that we can search off of core, I will be content. Don't mistake that for happiness because I want my power bond searcher, but I will be definitely content if uh, we don't get the power bond searcher and this is our just our new cyber card because, you know, it's nice having something else, you know, another good cyber card to search besides your repair plant. I've been searching just repair plant for years now, guys. It's nice to have another option. So yeah, guys, like I just said, I really enjoyed this card. Go ahead and let me know what you think about it down in the comment section because I would really like to know. Uh, but until next time, guys, and until Cybernetic Horizon comes out, let's go ahead and get into some fan mail. All right, so this one is from Alec Mendoza, our tier two, our tier two champ. Oh my gosh, let's see, let's see what he had to say today, man. This guy's freaking crazy. So we have a letter, some cards, a bunch of cards, and I think that is everything out of that, although I like to look and check because, man, I'm telling you, there was one time I left a card in there on accident, and I had to send a, a subsequent letter to somebody <laughs> to get them their card back that was still in an envelope. So ever since then, I've been kind of uh, paranoid about leaving something in an envelope the back of this this letter by the way is hilarious already but um, hey yugi dodo uh first time in a long time uh, competing in one of the local tournaments my power bond ancient gears uh before the before the legendary duelist pegasus packs were out gave an invocation draco masterpiece uh, deck a duel worth remembering well good uh, round two was up against a uh, trick stars and my opponent ash blossom my desires but i took revenge by power bonding my ultimate ancient gear golem and taking game met, met another ancient gear fan and unfortunately i don't remember his name but surprise Surprisingly, he uh, bought me a Le uh, Dragons of Legends 2 pack. That was really nice, uh, which I pulled a, a Mirror Force Dragon, the Time Wizard, a Fusion Equip card, and Tyrant Wing Dragon. There are many uh, more cards I hope uh, you can sign, absolutely. Um, after that experience, um, after that experience, it has changed my point of view of how fun uh, local tournaments can be. And when I'm free, I will definitely uh, enter another one and see uh, uh, who I'll meet next time. Well, good luck uh, when you, whenever you decide to go again. Uh, recently, I bought uh, the uh, Legendary Collection uh, Kaiba box, and some cards I pulled I also hope you can sign. Uh, $45 at my local is way too expensive. Uh, when I uh, when I can get a box of the Legendary Duelist with Pegasus on it, I will boost up my Ancient Gears and see how far uh, they will uh, they will go at my locals. Um, so you need uh, the Ancient Gear Fusion. Is that what it's called? I'm pretty sure that's what it's called. Um, second turn OTK for the win, and that's game. Sincerely, Alec M. Uh, also, the second uh, page is for Eugene. Eugene, I've Come for you, multiply. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> oh, get wrecked. <laughs> That's freaking good. Oh my gosh, dude. Absolutely. I will sign. Yes, I will sign all of these. All of them, dude. All of them. Um, what, what, what did you send though? So, Mirror Force Dragon. Yo, so all the cards, like all the cards you were talking about, Tire Burst. Um, all the cards from uh, the Legendary Collection, Kaiba, Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon, which was a crazy good reprint. All these Ancient Gear cards. This is way cool, dude. Way cool. Dark Magicians, uh, Clear Karibo, um, uh, Curry Bandits. Oh my gosh. Uh, Blue Eyes, uh, Blue Eyes, uh, a Dark Burning Attack, Dark Burning, a uh, Dark uh, Burning Magic. So, um, you know, Dark Magician stuff, Future uh, Future Fusion, Pot of Desires, another Dark Magician. Dude, thank you. Thank you so, so much for writing all the time. Thank you so much for this because this is freaking hilarious. I will absolutely sign all these and get them right back your way. Thank you so much for writing again. Subscribe! <laughs>